You just purchased a C25 machine. In this video, you'll find some interesting advice and instructions with the goal that you can use the machine and accessories to their best. The machine has two functions. First, is cutting out the paper that will be the material used to customize our products. The second one is to help assembling the different promotional metal items such as keyrings, pins, bag holders, etc. To get started, place the black plastic ball onto the handle just like it is shown on the image. The cutting nylon base will be used only when using the die cuts to cut off the paper. It is absolutely necessary to fix the C25 onto the wooden base provided with the machine before you start using it. There are two holes on the back part of the machine for this purpose. Please secure the machine up with a couple of screws. When the machine is tight and stable, we can guarantee the appropriate functioning and it will help us to not waste energy when using the C25. There are two different cutting tools we can use on the machine. The die cuts, UC, and the punch cutters, MC. The die cuts, or UC, are more simple and you can cut several papers at a time when using them. To use the die cuts, we must fix it to the C25 as you can see. Place the cutter into the machine and tighten it until it holds. Afterwards, place the white nylon circle on the base of the machine. The machine is ready to cut. Place one or several papers beneath the die cut and over the nylon. Pull the handle to proceed with cutting. For using the punch cutter, MC, on the machine, we will slide it into the frame between the base and the mobile part until it gets adjusted. A small pressure on the top of the punch cutter will help us to create a gap between the two pieces and make the introduction smoother. The punch cutter, MC, is a cutting tool that will help you to register the image easily and to be very accurate on the precision of cutting out a paper. Attention, with this kind of punch cutter, you can only cut one single paper at a time. We can easily change one size or shape to another one and repeat the process with a different punch cutter to cut out a different paper to make a new item. Once the papers are cut, we are ready to place them on the metallic key rings with the help of the assembling moulds. The assembling moulds, UM, are used in the process of manufacturing metal key rings. Assembling moulds comprise of two parts. The upper part, or pusher, is fixed on the upper part of the machine. We will secure it with the lateral screw. The assembling base is placed on the base of the machine, and here is where the key ring lies while assembling. How to assemble the products. Take, for instance, a keyring. Place the printed and ready cut paper on the keyring inlay and the plastic cover on top of it. Pull the handle until the cover and paper get stuck inside of the metal keyring. For assembling acrylic products, we will only use the machine for cutting out the paper, but the assembling is totally done by hand, pressing with the fingers the cover inside the keyring body. We can change assembling tools, repeating the action and assemble different items in a fast and easy way. We follow once again the same procedure. Place the paper on the key ring and press the plastic cover on it with the assembling tool. Fast and easy.